Happy Thursday. So, today's a, an anniversary for me. Um, 20 years without a drink or a drug. And, I, I mean, personally, this anniversary is more important to me than a birthday. <clears throat> because it's when I finally... <laughs> was granted a reprieve from this insanity that I lived with for, you know, 27 years before I was able to do anything about it and willing to do anything about it, you know, take responsibility for my life. And the reprieve was nothing short of a miracle. You know, something bigger than me helped me. And I don't, you know, define that however you want. But I couldn't have done it. But it, it wasn't, a, I wasn't able to stop, to even conceive. I didn't even want to. And over the last 20 years, it's been the support of friends and family and community that have kept me sane, you know, and, uh, and, and like shepherded me into like opening my heart and being and striving to be the best human being I can every day. And it's every day, every day, a new day, every day it's work, every day it's a challenge, every day I get to be grateful, every day I get to have an experience. I get to be miserable if I want. And all of those things took so much time and beautiful resistance and acceptance and resistance and acceptance until I remembered something. Uncover, discover, and discard. Just all of these things that I talk about, like, it didn't happen overnight. And I'm, I'm, I don't know how, there's no there there. I just get to keep waking up every day to a new day, to a new experience, to a new moment and hopefully learn something from the moment before. I mean, that's the beauty of being human. I can generally remember what I've done. And, you know, if I desire, I can work at being a better person, a better member of society. How can I be of service? Because I didn't, I didn't just not do anything for the, I didn't just abstain for the last 20 years. I, I couldn't do that. I did that. Well, I didn't really ever just abstain. I had to do work. I had to uncover and discover and discard because if it was just about not picking up for me, I would have probably exploded or killed somebody or killed myself. I've had to... I've, I've gotten an opportunity to help other people in my life, hopefully. Well, I know I've helped at least one. I know that. So, I, this is, I, it's terrifying and amazing, the journey. To let go of something that you use as a security blanket and walk forward with an open heart and an open mind and the willingness to learn and the courage to learn is amazingly challenging and beautiful and rewarding. I don't, I, I do my best to not run from things today, emotionally, physically. I want to be present. Much love.